everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing a tag video. This is the first tag I will be doing on this channel. I hope to do many, many more in the future. Um, and this tag is the new tube booktube tag and this was created by Trina over at Between Chapters. So I will have her channel linked in the description box below. So you guys should, should totally check her out. And this tag is just a little bit about uh, me, how I got started booktubing, why I started my channel, and yeah. So number one is where are you joining us from? And I am joining you guys from beautiful Boston, Massachusetts. Uh, number two is how old are you? I am 19 years old. Number three is how did you, or why did you join booktube? I joined booktube so I could share my love of books and um, like some of my favorite books with the entire world. Um, so you guys could maybe check those out too. Number four is, what is the meaning behind your channel name? My channel name is also the name of my book blog, which I started before I had my channel. Um, I started my blog back in like mid to late April, and I started my channel soon after that, I think a week or two after that. Um, and Evil Queen is like, I chose the Evil Queen as my primary, primary name because, um, it's like the name of all my social media um, for all of my personal stuff and everything. And then books is obviously because um, I love books. Number five is who are some of your favorite authors? Some of my favorite authors include J.K. Rowling, obviously, uh, who, who who obviously wrote Harry Potter, my favorite series of all time. Uh, also Veronica Roth, who wrote Divergent. Uh, Suzanne Collins, who wrote The Hunger Games. Um, and... <laughs> Obviously, my favorite book of all time was written by him, and that was Pete Wentz, um, who wrote Grey, uh, my favorite book of all time, and he wrote only one other book um, that I haven't read, um, but I hope he writes more in the future. Um, number six, what books do you read or want to talk about on here? Um, I read a lot of different types of genres. I read mostly, I read a lot of dystopian, I read a lot of fantasy, mostly, I read mostly fantasy, but, um... I also read science fiction, historical fiction, um, mostly young adult, um, some middle grade occasionally. I also read some new adult, and I haven't read any adult books, but I might in the future. Um, number seven, what is the last book you read? The last book I read was Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire by J.K. Rowling. I read that last month, and I'm reading um, the next book in the series, which I'll talk about in a second um, right now. Um, I'm rereading the entire series so I can read The Cursed Child when I'm all done with it because I'm really excited to read that. Uh, and number eight is what are you currently reading? Again, I'm reading Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix, which is the fifth book, right after The Goblet of Fire, which is the fourth book in the Harry Potter series, also by J.K. Rowling. Uh, number nine is what do you use for bookmarks? I use just regular bar bookmarks. Sometimes I use like a piece of string that I have like laying around the house or something if I don't have anything to use. Sometimes I'll use like scrap paper. Um, I usually don't do the dog eat your folds in the corners, but if I absolutely have to, I will. Um, number 10, show us your current TBR pile. I have such a large TBR pile, it would be like impossible to bring it all here because it's so large, but some of my books on the TBR include um, Outlander by Diana Gabaldon, the rest of the Harry Potter series, so Lord of the Phoenix, Papal Prince, Deputy House, and The Cursed Child. Um, I am number 4 by Phoenix Lore, The Fifth Wave by Rick Yancey, the Maze Runner by James Dashner, um, The Lost Hero by Rick Riordan, um, and also the rest of the Heroes of Olympus series by Rick Riordan. Um, that's just to name a few. I have a, quite a large TBR pile. Uh, number 11, what do you prefer? And there's three different categories. So the first one is hardcover or paperback. Hardcover all the way. I will read paperback though if it's not the mass market paperbacks. I'm not a big fan of those um, unless I absolutely have to buy them. Number two is uh, electronic book or paperback, uh, physical copy. Uh, physical copy, I will read ebooks all um, sometimes if I absolutely have to, but I usually like the physical copies of books. And the last part is uh, owning or borrowing. I prefer owning, but I do go to the library a lot more than I shop for books, but I do prefer owning the books. Um, which book series got you into reading is number 12. Uh, I have a, quite a few, so, <laughs> books or series. So, the first series that ever, I ever read, uh, was Twilight by Stephanie Meyer. Um, another one I read that I really liked was The Hunger Games by Suzanne Collins. I wrote that such a long time ago, though. 
Um, I might reread it. I'm not sure yet. Um, another series was Divergent. Really love those books. And the one uh, standalone I read that is my favorite, again, my favorite book of all time is Great by Pete Wentz. That's really what started me, started wanting me to get into BookTube and my book blog. Um, number 13 is How Did You Discover BookTube? I discovered BookTube. I was just looking all around on YouTube one day and seeing if anybody actually did reviews for books as a like channel thing. I saw quite a few. The first one I ever checked out was um, Sasha over at a Book Utopia. That is my favorite BookTube channel, but I brought in my horizon quite a bit since then. Um, she was the first one I ever watched, and I still watch her to this day. Um, number 14, what challenges do you think you'll face with your own channel? Um, with my own channel, I the only problem I'm going to face, um, it's not one I'm going to face right now, but maybe in the next couple months, is when I start to go back to school, is keeping up with my schedule. Um, I don't really have a dead set schedule right now, but I'm trying to upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and occasionally on either Saturday or Sunday, just depending on how busy I am. But once school starts, I'm going to be in my second semester of college, um, so... I'm not sure. I'm only going to be taking one class, but I might be really busy with, like, papers and everything. And also, I'm writing my book, so I, that's another thing. But that's, I think that I'll be fine um, keeping up with my schedule. Hopefully, cross my fingers. And number 15, which is the last and final question, where else can we find you? Link up, which means my social media. So, I have only, I don't have a lot of social media, but I do have, um... Twitter, Instagram, good and Goodreads, which my Twitter and Instagram are both at Evil Queen Books. My Goodreads is just my name, Jackie Gorham. Um, those are all linked in the description box below. I also have a, another channel that I had long before I had this one. I don't really use it anymore, but I, um, try, I'm going to try to m upload more on that as well. Um, and that's also in the description box below. Again, it's just my name, Jackie Gorham. Um, and, uh, yeah, so that is the entire tag, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you give it, if you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. If you guys would like to see more tags, uh, please let me know in the comments below, and tell me which ones you want to see. Um, I'll be happy to get to them, um, eventually sometime in the future. Also, be, um, in, be on the lookout for more videos coming, um, every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday for now. Um, I have quite a few reviews to do, so I'll, I, I think I'm going to do my Rebel of the Sands by Alan Hamilton review on Friday, so be on the lookout for that, and I will talk to you guys in my next video very, very soon. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye!